When we formed the union here, this hollow where you came up today was where the union was born, United Mine Workers. Oh. They was 150 miners at one time in West Virginia. They was 260,000 all told across the nation. Let me tell you, let me give you the history of the mining, mining the labor force. 1928, there was 750,000 miners. Of course, they didn't belong to a union then. And then a few years later, they formed a union. In 1955, there was 260,000 union miners. Today, there's less than 30,000 union miners. And now, we're outnumbered 80,000 80, non-union miners to less than 30,000 union miners in the United States. In West Virginia, we have less than 12,000 miners. Where's this going, people? Going to sales, we're doing the coal field battles and the organizing of the union. Y'all, how many of y'all know about the Battle of Blair Mountain? Yeah. 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 Well, there it is. The United States back then bound, bound their own people because they wanted to have the right to organize. The United States back then bound their own people because they wanted a day's wages for a day's work. We're not getting that no more. And right now, the government is still in the pay in, in, in the bed with the industry, whether it's coal or sports yeah. arenas or chemical. Mm -hmm. It really doesn't matter. Yes. 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 Money yes. is still right. riding right. with the government. Y'all yep. got people dying here, drinking poison water, and you coming up here cracking jokes. I bought your water for you. How come I got to buy water when I had water for 200 and some years That's and right. one, one dynamite blast, they dropped my water? Mm -hmm. wow. How come I got to buy? And then he said, well, don't the coal company have to bring you water? Oh, sure. They'll bring me water. I got to go get a lawyer. Then I got to pay the lawyer to prove that they dropped the water. Then I got to pay the lawyer to prove that I had water for 230 years. Then I got to pay the lawyer to tell people my water was good. Y'all come from all parts of the country here today. Go to show you that injustice does not happen just in your backyard. It happens in all of our backyards. Yes. A man once said, injustice to anyone is injustice to everyone. Yeah. You know, somebody asked me yesterday, what keeps me going? How come I keep going? To me, this is a human rights issue. One of the things that this man said some 40 some years ago, he said, if a man doesn't stand for human rights, and he's 36 years old, if a man doesn't stand because dogs are going to bite him, or if a man doesn't stand because he's afraid of billy clubs, or if a man doesn't stand because of intimidation factors, and he's 36 years old, and he lived to be 90, he, he would have died at 36. Y'all yeah. know who said that. A man called King. Remember? Yeah. Maybe not in the exact words, or maybe I didn't just say it right, but I'll tell you what, I can remember when he said them words. What's going to be out there on any of this land in the next 2,500, 3,000 years? We have 3 million acres destroyed, less than 5% they've ever done any, anything with. And all these dams are putting above the ground, this poison the land. All the mine waste and Jackson are putting back, and we don't have a right to have our say here. There ain't no damn bit of difference between what I'm doing here and what you're fighting, who you at. Mm -hmm. That's right. It's a hard yeah. struggle. Yeah. Yeah. Same battle, same battle. It's a power struggle. It's the wealthy. You know, a reporter came here yesterday. You see, they, uh, well, no, Sunday is a National Ge Ge Geographic. You see, I have been in about every kind of magazine, uh, TV news, uh, around the world, they wrote about me. But it really doesn't matter. It really doesn't. It don't matter, Bert, if they don't act on what they hear. It don't matter if y'all have all the facts in the world here. True. It's funny, like Gwen did. And y'all leave, and, 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 and you don't act on what you hear. Now I want to ask you one more thing. Listen like this. Listen to me, brother. Listen, remember, you heard me say this. What do you have so close to your own circle of life, my friend? What do you have so close to your own circle of life that you don't have a place on? Yes. What would it be for true, you? True, true. What would it be for you, buddy? What would it be for you? And, and you didn't have a price on it? 
and they forced their will anyhow, and they destroyed what you have. How far would you go to stand for, my friends? And what would you do? I made promises to my people across the land. I said, you listen to me. Listen. And if you listen, I won't back up. I'll hold my place. I won't back up. And I'll hold my place. I made that promise to the people across this country. Because you see, I can't win this battle by myself. It's not my battle alone to save Appalachia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. well, well, it's, it's yours. well. It's yours. Y'all own Appalachia as well. <laughs>